Hi YouTube, I'm here with Chris and Sonia from So You Think You Can Dance, choreographers. Yes. So tell us about your pieces tonight. It was Melise and Marco. It was supposed to be Melise and Jade, but Jade unfortunately injured himself. It was very sad. Um, but Melise was absolutely exquisite and I learned so much as a choreographer. She learned so much as a dancer. My hands get really dramatic. It was it was beautiful. She, she made me so proud and she should be 10 feet tall right now because she just was exquisite. We were talking about the group number that we did and how it, like, it kind of made us like hold our breath a bit while we're watching it. And I think the duet did that for me as well. My favorite thing with choreography is when I don't predict it. When I'm like, oh, what are they going to do? Oh, they're going to do that. Oh, oh, they didn't do that. And, and I think it did that the entire piece. Um, it's so it's inspiring. No, it really was. And um, so you get me emotion. See, <laughs> Lexi. See, Lexi. Tell me about the group piece from the Top 18 performance. Tell me all about it. How did you, what was the influence? What was the motion after? Tell me all about it. Let's just get some deets. <laughs> Let's get comfortable. We got some okay. couches. Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah. There we go. There we go. Like, I guess the whole thing, we can go back last season when we did the collaboration um, the first time. It was really, literally one of the best collaboration experiences I've had. Um, there's, like a spe there's like a special trust that I think when we work together, um, I trust her 100% artistically and and as, as everything. One of my favorite things with working with Sonia is that um, even it's happened multiple times where I have a move that I'm like trying to do and I can't quite explain it to the kids. And it's, it's not even tech, like a contemporary type move, but somehow she figures out, she understands how to explain it to the kids and she'll say something. She's like, it's from here guys and you have to undulate and and evaporate and I'm like I don't know what that means but they get it somehow now so thank you. I'm obsessed with Chris. Who's not obsessed with Chris? He's amazingly creative, super humble, really nice and um, constantly striving for, for artistic integrity not just uh, uh, props or um, it's not an egotistical approach, it's, it's simply, not simply, but for the love of art. And that's what I love about him. Okay, so how did this whole collab, awesome team, whatever you guys want to call it on YouTube, yeah. how did this come together? Um, it was just one of those things where I think we are just talking about, it. let's just do a thing together, let's just do it. And everybody was kind of like, okay, you guys really want to do a piece together? And we're like, I think so, yeah, let's just do a piece. Like, all right, let's do it. And then we did it. Seeing his piece and then walking past him and being like, yo, like stopping and, and saying, we should... I don't know how, but we, this needs to happen. Like it just, it was radiating. Any human being that is humble, that wants to share the, the intellect of dancing is amazing. And I think that, that it, it's lacking. Camaraderie and collaboration is lacking. So having this is a dream because it, it helps uh, get my brain going. It, it's thought provoking constantly. I'm Sonia Taya. And I am Chris. And you are watching Totally, totally Lexi. Lexi. Bam. <laughs>